Here we go then, Connor. Another year at the TT 2018, another campaign about to get underway. Yeah, it's um, it's all come round all all quick all of a sudden. Um, really looking forward to it. Um, get to race around my, my home track. There's worse things to do for two weeks, well, four weeks of the year. <laughs> oh, indeed. And a very settled situation with you and the Padgett's team now. Yeah, everything's all uh, working a treat uh, with Padgett's. You know, it was, it was good to get the the deal done um, back end of last year. Know exactly where we're, you know, what way we're shaping up for 218, and uh, yeah, we're just ready to go. It's, uh, it's been a long winter, but it's enabled us to prepare. I've certainly prepared myself as best I possibly can, and I know for sure that the team have as well uh, as they always do. So, real looking forward to racing the bikes in in May. Is it the same set of bikes as last year? Have they got anything new for you? There's a few little uh, tweaks, but. That all remains to be seen. Um, we always strive to to push on and improve. Uh, the reality is, last year didn't really get a good stab at it because of my injury. Um, but this year we're, we're, we'll be ready, and uh, I'm really looking forward to it, actually. Yeah, by their own high standards, Patches had a bit of a disappointing TT 2017 in general with Bruce as well. Yeah, it was. I think it was a bit of a tricky TT. Um, not only for myself, as as you say there. My teammate Bruce didn't have a particularly great one himself, but you know sometimes it just goes that way. Um, I certainly didn't feel good about not getting or bringing any results to the table at all. Um, but all I can do is reassess and you know analyse everything that I've done and look at stuff that I can do differently for for this year's event. And I've had a had a look at myself, you know, a long hard look at myself and. Uh, you know, there's things that have changed and we're ready to go. Looking forward to it. Are you still confident that you can challenge for race victories here on the mountain course? Yeah, absolutely. I think um, otherwise it's, I just wouldn't do it. You know, if, it, if I didn't feel competitive, I think I would, I'd just totally throw the towel in altogether. Um, There's a lot of hard work which has gone on over the years just to sort of carry on for the sake of it. Um, but there's no two ways about it. I, just, I really want to win races, uh, particularly around here and uh, I firmly believe that I can do it. Fastest lap at the moment of 131.7 miles per hour, yeah. which in fairness probably wouldn't be at the level to win races. So have you identified places in yourself, the team, the bike, where you can get to that next level? Yeah, absolutely. I mean, years gone by, I mean, without dwelling on it, I mean, 2010, you know, there was no one that was going to get near me really on a superbike. And I, I firmly believe that the kit that I've got underneath me now uh, on their own could carry me around and get a good strong result if I'm fully fit on the day. Um, everything's there. Um, 131.7 isn't going to, as you say, cut it. But, um, you know, I think we can certainly get back there and up the speeds. Um, you know, last year I did a 130 with a broken wrist. So, you know, I think the pace is there. You know, just everything's just got to come together on the day, really. You know, and we, as I say, we've been working hard, and I'll be working double hard on on race day. And in terms of the early part of the season, testing and going into that first part of the season up to the Northwest 200, is there any great plans? Yeah, yeah, we've um, got a two-day test coming up Tuesday, Wednesday. It's a Dunlop tyre test at Castle Coombe. Um, that happens every year. Uh, I missed that last year through injury again. Um, we've got that coming up next week, and then we roll straight into round one of. Uh, the British Superbike and we're riding in Superbike class for that as well so that's just purely aimed at getting some good track time on a Superbike. Um, again it's all geared towards them two weeks really for me. And making up for a little bit of lost time last year with the injuries? Basically yeah, yeah, yeah. just basically trying to put everything, just throw off in the kitchen sink at it really as we do every year um, and just try harder so that's all we can do, put 100% at it. But I think there's no reason why we can't get results, really. Um, I'm just really excited to see what it brings to us, you know. Wish you the best of luck. Thank you.